problem with floors not collapsing was a big one because that's really where all the experts were hanging their hat on, this pancake theory. Well, these floor models didn't fail in the furnaces. You know, they all passed the test for two hours. Two hours, of course, is longer than either of the buildings stood. There has just been a huge explosion. We can see uh, a billowing smoke rising. And we heard the noise uh, associated with an implosion. We heard a very loud blast, an explosion. We looked up and the uh, building literally began to collapse before us. We heard a loud explosion. And at that point, building two was collapsing. At that point, we heard a large boom. Um, you know, I looked up and just saw the building coming at us. Do you, do you know if it was an explosion or if it was a building collapse? To me, it sounded like it. it to me, it sounded like an explosion. There was another major explosion. The build, the building itself, literally the top of it came down. All of a sudden, you hear explosion, and you could see the building starting to collapse. Huge explosion that we all heard and felt. We understand now there has been a secondary explosion on Tower 2. According to the Associated Press, another building that has either been attacked or exploded. The tower, rather, that has collapsed, and we are told, collapsed because of a third explosion. And about an hour later after that, there was a huge explosion at the base of the South Tower. Huge explosion at the base of the South Tower. Which again feeds that feeling that there was something else, that there may have been something else that brought those buildings down. There was a lot of talk there in New York of, a, of a, another explosion prior to the collapse of the first building. Uh, we could hear a rumble, which was uh, about five seconds long, preceding the actual collapse, and then a boom uh, when each of those towers collapsed. Uh, just seconds ago, there was a huge explosion, and it appears right now the second World Trade Tower has just collapsed. I was about five blocks away when that, uh, I heard uh, explosions. And then you heard from far away, boom, boom and you heard the boom, 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 boom. Floor by floor, it started popping out. It was like, it was if, if, if they had detonated, yeah, you know, as detonated, if they were planned yeah. to take down a building. Boom, 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 boom. From the corner, boom, 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 boom. Just like 20 straight hits. And as the bombs were gone, people just started running. And I And just the debris field is uh, amazing. It's beyond anything I've ever seen like that. It's, I've seen collapses and, and de demolition buildings, but nothing like this was unbelievable. Like I said, there wasn't a door. There wasn't anything to be found. It was all disintegrated, all rubble. Concrete was small little pieces, not even slabs. Uh, no desk, no furniture, no computers, no phones, no anything. So I imagine. I imagine the, so the people were the same as the, the building, nothing left. Everything was pulverized. There was, you know, there were no desks, there were no phones, there were, you know, maybe now and then you find a fragment of something, but basically everything was just pulverized. There wasn't a, 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 a computer screen, a laptop, the, uh, there was no what was it. I mean, it, it was, you know, two 110 story buildings of office equipment. 
it reminded me my father-in-law said the same thing like a demolition explosion yeah it's like the bottom dropped right out from it, right exactly bill it was just like it rolled like when you see stadiums go down when they knock or, or old buildings it, it it we we said to each other my god it i said you know the the, the, the bottom part of the building looked fine and all of a sudden boom it started rolling it yeah. was like it was like it was the explosion was coming from uh inside yeah yeah yeah, it's just no, no. It's just another uh, Oklahoma City job, uh, yeah. and of course the planes. You know that that's. But yeah, I, I agree, Bill. Those planes couldn't have taken that building down like no that. No way, no way. Absolutely. Okay, Bill. Look, I'll let somebody else get on. And, and especially both of them. Exactly. I mean, it's just exactly. it's a yeah. perfect demolition of two huge, tremendously strong towers that were built to withstand forces that. You can't even imagine. And you're trying to tell me that an airplane took them down? Yeah, no way, Bill. No way. No way. Didn't help. No, think... Well, uh, I've watched uh, on the Learning Channel, you know, demolitions, and they, they're taking down buildings, and some of them they can't take down. It's, so well engineered. It's not easy to bring down a building, and it's really hard to make it collapse exactly straight down upon itself, and that's the art of demolition. Because if you do it wrong, it'll fall over and crush, you know, a whole bunch Half of buildings, right. you know, uh, that, that it falls on.
should have kept all this shit to yourself, you know? Yeah. Cause all that Illuminati bullshit, I don't know if that shit real or not, but hey, if it is, you can just piss all them motherfuckers off. You better go and hide, bitch. Yeah, man, I wonder why people just don't walk away, man. Why you gotta start shit? Yeah, hey, you gonna make some money off you running your fucking mouth? Yeah, now you got everybody. Now you got, now if this, this is true, you got these motherfuckers looking for you. Yeah, man, I ain't fucking no Illuminati. Yeah, man. You know how many times I got an email, hey, do a video on Illuminati? I ain't touching that fucking subject. I got a wife and kids to, to look after. 